Hello, hello. What have we got here? Because batteries are responsible for the death of millions of dolphins every year, you must think of an eco-friendly power solution for a camera. This message is written on recycled paper. Hmm, got an idea. And one more thing, a flat cap. So let's get started with creating world peace and happiness. As it's summertime, I'm going to make use of solar energy. Need a bit of space for the fan. Use some tape. What a ridiculous idea. It's not going to work. <laughs> I'm going to mount it back here. Do 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 Voila! This will be powering our camera. It's got lithium ion battery inside of this. So the solar rays will charge it up and this will be enough to power up a compact camera. I'm a bit worried about the quality of this. I mean, look at it. The solar panels aren't even straight and it's made in China, but not in a good way. So I'm kind of worried that it might blow up in my face. There we have it, the finished product. <laughs> this is gonna be the worst video ever. Look at that. So that's gonna go on top of my head. So if it explodes, this part of my head will be caved in. Look at that. Now we have to think about how to connect it up to our camera. Here comes the moment of truth. Yes! Oh, it's on video mode. Look at that. Today is nice and sunny. So let's go outside and try out our new eco-friendly camera. So we've come to Mong Kok, the busiest place in Hong Kong, to test out our new solar-powered camera. And because this is a place where fashion trends are created and ended in the same day, I thought this would be the only right place to come to test out my new solar-paneled flat cap. Unfortunately, my head's sort of blocking the fan. Well, hopefully when the sun shines on this solar panel, it won't rip my face apart. Let's go. Hong Kong has some of the worst pollution in Hong Kong. 
this hat changing the way that we smell air forever oh it's a mobile softy yes unfortunately the thing with solar charging is that it takes absolutely ages to fully charge the lithium-ion battery it takes 10 hours to charge it to full capacity well we haven't got time to burn so uh Hope you've got enough battery life to get us through the shoot. This one is very handy that it's connected by a cable. You just put it in your pocket. Which, which means that you won't lose one or the other. You either have them both or you lose them all. Let's go for some sun. I think the people are quite receptive to my new trend. We have power. away at my forehead. The, the battery meter seems to be playing up a bit. I think we need more power. Let's go into the sun for a bit. When you, you're kidding me, aren't you? I need power! Oh no! Is caught in the fan. Children of the future, this is the way forward. Solar powered flat caps. People, solar caps are going to be the next big thing in technology. Even bigger than the iPhone. You laugh now. See, last time I had the 3D camera strapped to my face. I merely look like Wally. But this time, standing on the sun waiting for recharge, I am him. Yo, yo, yo. Oh, it's switching itself off now. Come on. Oh no! What's going on? Have we actually charged this for 10 hours? Under the sun? What do we not in the sun? In the office? But we don't have a sun inside the office. You do know that, don't you? It's ridiculous. It's hot and sticky. There's no sunlight. It's not charging up my camera. The fan's not working. Although sometimes it rips out my hair. I'm tired. Being environmentally friendly is a good thing. This, it's a bit silly really. Just drive back in a Mercedes. Put aircon to maximum. 